Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Cars and Cloud. So in this video, this is my second video on creating um, a Visio and Project Volume License installations. So if you have Office 365 deployed in your environment and you don't have license for the the um, Visio P2 license, you can deploy the MSI version, which is the volume license. So now let's get started. First of all, you have to download the the Microsoft Office Deployment Toolkit. Just have to go to Google and type in download Office ODT. Click on Download Office Deployment Toolkits. It's the very top uh, link. So once you download it and extract it, so I have it extract here on my C drive. This is what it, it gives me. And you have to run the, you can watch my other video how to download the, the, um, the installation files. All you have to do is just write, um, run the setup.exe and then, and then the, um, the command line is, let me show you here, change directory to ODT, just type in setup.exe. And slash download. And then the name of the config file. So if you're going to need x86, you're going to use x86. And if you need x64, you're going to use x64 XML file. So I have the file downloaded. The con all the contents has been downloaded. And here's what I have. I'm going to minimize the screen. Here's what I have. So I created a custom installation, which is Office 365. And this one is also include Visio volume license and project volume license. Let's open it up. And if you look here, it's going to install Office 365 Pro Plus. And also it's going to install Visio volume license and if you want to include project volume license you have to enter this um, project volume license key which is PID key number you can grab this information from the Microsoft website let's go to this link here So here's the keys for the installation. If you have standard versions, you're going to have to use this key. And professional, you use this key. So these are all four keys for different addition of Visio and projects. So once you have the, MX, the X, XML file created, you can run the installation from a command line, or you can create an SCCM package. Let's take a look at my um, test machine here. That's the wrong one. Let's take a look at O2. Hmm. I'm going to um, remove all these first and then I will run the install to show you how it's going to look. Let's take a look at the SCCM applications that I created for Office 365 with Visio and Project Volume License. 
as you can see here, I have multiple applications for Office 365. I have Office 365 Pro Plus only without visual projects. So this one I just created. If you go to properties of this applications, the name of the applications, software center, reference, distribution setting, deployment type, so the deployment type here, if you look at the contents this, and programs. So the program, it launches um, the setup.exe space slash configured and the name of the config file. So this will install Office 365 and Visio volume license plus project volume license. So that's the, I'm going to distribute the contents. So again, um, if you want just the visual only, all you have to do is just remove projects from it just like that and if you want just the office only you can remove this as well so and if you want the to install visual by itself or add it later after office 365 I created an, uh, a different um, XML file just for office uh, just for visual only it, it looks something like this I don't need this. So it's going to be um, just a config file. All it is is just configurations and, um, and oh, this is the wrong one. Actually, I created the for the project one. So it looks something like this exactly. All you have to do is just if you want it for um, if you want to create one for Visio, just replace project with Visio. Um, Visio Professional and then the you replace the whole thing just replace the whole thing so that's install by itself the volume license by itself so now go back to my test device and um, we're going to remove all the applications and then reinstall it All right, as you can see, I have Office uninstall. So now I'm going to install the Office Pro Plus, I'm sorry, Office 365 with Visio and Volume License. So what you have to do is just run the command line, setup.exe, and then forward slash configure, and then the name of your config file, the XML file. So I'm going to hit Enter, or click OK. Let's minimize the screen. Confirm the installation. So this should install Office 365 and volume license for Visio and projects. Looks like we are about 90% completed. Right, as you can see here, if Office Installation has finished, but it's going to take a few seconds to close this window. Here it is. Close it out. Let's go back to Programs and Features. Refresh. And there it is. Office Pro Plus and Project Plus Visio. And if I go to open up Visio. All right, Visio is open. Let's look at the account. As you can see here, it's Microsoft Visio Professional, which is that is the volume license. If it's the um, the Office 365 version, which is called the P2 Visio, you're gonna see um, Visio P2 
two or something like that. So that's it. If you have any questions, um, feel free to put it in the comment section. I'm going to uh, paste the link to the Microsoft website on this one in the comment section as well. So you can just copy and uh, create your own XML file. Thank you for watching. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe. Have a great day.